Bharat Heavy Electricals Limited has released a tender for the manufacturing of components for heat exchangers of the Tejas Mark 1 fighter jets, which involves CNC cutting, machining, drilling, precision pressing and grinding. BHEL had received the order for the supply of compact heat exchanger sets for 83 Tejas Mark 1A fighters in February this year, and the order envisages manufacturing assembly testing and supply of compact heat exchangers to Hindustan Aeronautics. Heat exchangers help to control heat and maintain temperature by removing excess heat from the systems. The DRDO is developing an anti-torpedo torpedo system that uses a torpedo to seek and destroy acoustic homing torpedoes that are launched against surface ships and submarines. The anti-torpedo torpedo system will have an acoustic vector sensor on its nose, which detects the threat torpedo, and it moves towards it by measuring the distance from the torpedo and explodes at appropriate distance to destroy the threat torpedo. The DRDO is developing a next-generation weapon locating radar, in collaboration with private sector firm Astra Microwave Products Limited. It is a multifunction S-band active electronic scanning pulsed phased array tracking radar, with a detection range of 80 km for a target of radar cross-section of 0.03 square meters. It features automatic detection, multi-target tracking, and project recalculation of artillery shells, rockets and mortars. Hindustan Aeronautics Limited has sanctioned 42 crore rupees for the development of the first prototype of the high altitude pseudo satellite, and a prototype will be ready by the third quarter of 2022. Another component of the CATS program, the CATS Hunter air launched cruise missile, is currently going through design optimization and will carry out developmental CUM user trials in 2024. It will be optimized for high altitude and will be capable of twisting turning and skimming the landscape much better than other conventional cruise missiles. It will have a range of 200 km, and will drop a 250 kg warhead over the target, and can autonomously return back to the base, so that it can be refueled and rearmed for the next mission. HAL is also designing Alpha Pod that can be launched from aircraft, that will fly unpowered for a few kilometers and will release six Alpha S loitering munitions closer to its target. Indian Ministry of Defense has asked the three Indian armed services to consider two Israeli armed drones that are on offer to India, that includes the El Bitardani developed Hermes 900 UAV with 60% Indian made components, and the Heron TP offered by Israeli Aerospace Industries and Hindustan Aeronautics. The Hermes 900 can fly up to 30,000 feet, and has an endurance of 36 hours, and the proposed armed version can use a modular installation bay for carrying two saw weapons, or short-range air-to-ground laser-guided munition on wings, as the maximum payload capacity is only 350 kg. On the other hand, Hindustan Aeronautics has offered the Heron TP with indigenously developed SAW and Helena anti-tank guided missile, and it can also carry a special weapons bay to reduce drag and vibrations. The Heron TP has a max payload of 2,700 kg, and can fly up to 45,000 feet and has an endurance of 30 hours. Advanced Weapons and Equipment India has announced that the 155mm Sharang gun has been successfully inducted in three regiments of Indian Army. The 130mm Sharang was upgraded to 155mm, that has increased its range from 27 km to over 36 km, and the 200 crore rupees contract to upgrade 300 units will be completed in 2024.